you make investments in your house, you make investments in your car, you make investments in your children, we make investments in so many aspects of our lives. And to be able to have an opportunity to make an investment in yourself is something that, I, yeah, I, I think that a lot of people, they struggle with making that decision. But what, what I always say to people is like, look, we've got owner's manuals for every piece of machine in our house for our blender. We've got an owner's manual for, I just got a new iPhone. So we've got an owner's manual for the phone, but we really don't have any type of owner's manual for our brain and for the way that we think. And if you, if you truly want to become a master of the way that you think and be in control and learn to deliberately create the, the, the abundance around you, the best investment you can make is sitting down with a coach and getting that perspective. I mean, we go to the gym and we make investments there in our, in ourselves. And, and I think that that's what people have to realize is that you have been making investments in yourself, but never really in your mind. Now there's, there's school and there's education, but it's just a different level. Having a coach be able to sit down and explain that, look, there's nothing wrong with you. It's just the way that you're thinking about things. It's the, it's your perspective on things. That's just been invaluable for me mm -hmm. and the people that I've worked with as a result and seeing the difference that it made in my wife who had the opportunity to sit down and work with Joe, it, it freed her from years of just this mental torture that she was putting herself through because of her connection to things that were no longer serving her anymore. Old habits that no longer needed to serve a purpose. When she was younger, she had a, she had a, a, a situation with a family member that was a, a difficult situation. And that was, it, it served her at the time to, 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 not share and to, to, to be closed off and to put up walls to protect herself. She had, a, mm -hmm. she had an abusive stepfather. Um, but as an adult, that way of thinking no longer served her. And so to be able to see her be freed from those, you know, those chains of those old paradigms mm -hmm. by just working with a coach. And it's so simple. Some of the things that coaching does, the, the principles that your coach, that Joe shared with us, they were, they were very basic principles, but we just, we allow ourselves to become overthinkers and, and, and we think that by not doing anything or by not thinking those thoughts, we're not serving ourselves the right way. But in fact, those thoughts are just continuing to sabotage us and block our success. So it's, it's just been such an amazing opportunity to step into a world that I didn't know anything about. And, you know, I was very, I was very adamantly against sitting down with a coach. And, and I see that in so many people today, people that need it, people who are, people who are ready for a shift and ready to evolve and ready to get to a, a higher level of consciousness. And I think that anybody that's in that position, realize that if you're wanting, if you're noticing that there's something that needs to change, and then an opportunity where you meet a coach like Joe, realize that that's all part of the universe, just in mm -hmm. harmony with those thoughts of you wanting to shift and, and realize that things aren't happening to you, that this is a, a response to that vibration and this is happening for you. And just have that, have that courage to, to step into that arena where you can get that type of, of perspective. It's a beautiful thing.